upcoming player. So we're going on Smashville. So I'm rather surprised it's coming from um, from uh, Taka. Uh, I was thinking, yeah, you probably want to avoid a small stage like Smashville, but he does have the platform, and the platform is always uh, Cloud's uh, friend. He can just retreat to E8, charge a limit, and sometimes get saved by it during the recovery phase. I love how Taka tried to use any bit of a moment to charge his limit. Yeah. Like any frame is free to do so, he charged. Just there, we saw new to well, without a double jump, and having to retreat to the edge, but Taka giving him a... Oh, oh what? No! He didn't see... He, he, he might have thought he had to double jump and really didn't want to use his limit, and he didn't think to time, so wasting his stock a bit early. Yeah, that's sad, that's sad. But the match is not done yet. Everything yeah. can still happen. Now he's taking, well, good moment on that stock. Misses his, uh, his force match, unfortunately. Yeah, for now, Taka is not taking too much damage. He's just uh, being pretty, putting a good game of charging his limit and just as using up air on, uh, on Fila when he's, uh, he manages to launch him. And that's it, the limit is here. Yeah. Oh, red that roll. Don't see, yeah, I, I think one of the hits of side B was shielded by uh, Fila. And this is like 5% might have made the difference between a dead and a live on YouTube. Okay, so Fila needs to take as many percentage as he needs before that stock. <laughs> that wall Get out. Lead, yeah. So that suicide from Taka was basically non existent in the end. Only a 50% deficit. Yeah, not that much. And the Limic is back on deck, so he'll have all that mobility, get the up tilt. Yeah, punishes the landing, but very sloppily. I feel like Fila is not really comfortable in that matchup. Like, I can't really tell, he's like just moving, uh, I don't know what to say, just trying to make with some stuff, but does not really react like those kind of roles. Yeah, absolutely. He's La. trying to, to play from a distance, but uh, he gets, oh, there it is. I was about to say he gets shield grabbed and he loses basically this uh, mid-range game. Nice, nice up by Taka, knowing he could have been hit by that uh, charge shot, but, but that up smash from that jump from the ledge, really nice by Fila. Very, very simple player from him, no no extended combos, just reading the jumps with the up smashes and neutral Bs, playing it carefully. Yeah, it's really like, keep it simple, like really, really, really simple. Some roll, some shield, some down smash, some down tilt, just zoning around, not really like committing on any really hard choice, I would yeah, say. Absolutely. He's like, okay, I have this nearly entire start lead. I'll just grab my tech chases, small percent. There it is, the limit. Okay, he's used to recover. Yeah, he saw him jump like... Oh, oh wow. Okay. So he just saw him jump and just react with that of this. That was nice. So many grabs and forward throws from, uh, from Fila. At first, I was a bit surprised by the forward throw choice. Because it definitely won't put Cloud off stage, like uh, Baxter would. But uh, it's a lot of percent, and uh, when you have this much of a lead, if you can just tackle on enough percent, then it should be, yeah, the backstroke. Yeah, he just took his time. Oh! And that's it. Yeah. The, the platform was both a, a boon and a, a curse against Taka here, because it could have helped him recover if uh, Mewtwo was at the other side of the stage. But as he was here, he couldn't fall towards the edge because the platform was between him and that. So he tried to do it nonetheless, but the Fila was just waiting for him and just swiped him out with a, a back air. That's him because I really feel like, so Fila is, keep, is keeping it simple, like really, really simple. And I feel like on the other end, Take is taking too much. Like, yeah. he, he was like really on fire at the beginning, like uh, just charging uh, his limit always, you know, every frame that yeah, he could. Yeah, yeah, landing and, and stuff like that. More the matches goes uh, went on, unless he charged. Yeah. Uh, more he, ra he ran in. Yeah, I, he, I guess he, he got impatient after the, the suicide. Yeah. He was like, "Oh, I got this, and now, now he's just going to poke me to death and just grab me on over." Yeah, pro probably. Yeah, uh, and, losing and his cool. Yeah, and I would feel like playing at Sfila with that kind of playstyle would annoy a bit yeah. because he was like waiting a bit and just zoning, and you just run into his move. And you're like, ah, damn, 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 and you know? Definitely. I, I think he was just thinking too much, where Fila was just like, cool, simple, man. You run into me, no problem, no problem. So Dreamland and a switch from Fila. I'm actually, well, I'm not too surprised about the character switch, although I, I'm not sure it was necessary at all. Uh, I think Fila is just feeling comfortable now against Taka, so he's like, okay, my Luigi should work. But um, 
on the on the stage point of view, uh, I was thinking Gucci would be a better choice because with the platforms and in this, in this specific matchup, I think Legit could have a lot of trouble landing after he loses stage control. While Mewtwo could go for you know uh, edge cancel side bees and stuff. Maybe wow. he was all trapped. Maybe yeah. he was afraid by uh, the weight of Mewtwo. And maybe yeah, he was true. afraid by uh, just. Uh, Dying super early by up airs. Okay. Double up as how will he land? He has to head out to the ground. That guy is respecting the landings a bit too much, in my opinion. He, it was already apparent in the first game, but uh, Mewtwo has a lot of aerial mobility, so it can sometimes be good to respect him. But Luigi, you just need to get in there. Just like that, giving too much space in the end. <laughs> Again? No. Uh, yeah, I really feel like that can make me tons of movement, like, that does not are really important, but I feel like it's just acting for acting, where Villa is just watching of what happened, so it's just reacting where that can make a good, a bad placement. Yeah, or and that, that, at this point, he really could have been acting for, for with a clear purpose, like running towards Luigi after his side B. And that's oh. it, yeah. It's one of these back throws that's not that strong, but if you're at the edge, uh, the base knockback back will definitely kill you with a bit of rage. Yeah, and for that dash attack in that shield at that particular moment was not a really good idea for him. Takan not putting, yeah, Taka is not putting pressure or as I uh, as I said goes on. Uh, oh, oh, nice one, yeah. You won't edge guard me, <laughs> man. You won't block me. Calling the, the rising back air with a a B limit. Oh, nice combo. No, only a up air. It was waiting for a reaction. And like Taka just didn't do anything, it was Fila was lost. Yeah, he knew that at this point, you can't get a true combo with a forward, uh, the up air facing forward. So I just need to make sure you don't hit me. Yeah, that was a good choice. He has yeah, a. He's definitely putting the pressure on Luigi, uh, telling him like you, you can't fall over me. But he's not punishing the landing in the end, so he's not getting that much percent. But there it is, yep, the double uppers. And, and there it is, like he he lets him land for free. Gives him the same control to charge the limit. Yeah, I think he, f he felt like, okay, it's too far, I can follow my, keep up my pressure on my combo, so I just charge my limit. But unfortunately, he barely charge, and as you said, just let, it, let him land. So yeah, maybe not the best choice. Again, and once again, that yeah. up B. The, the early up B is even from the first game. Oh wow, oh, no. now this it. Okay, back throw, the limit obviously is gone. So this could be an edge guard situation. Rising up B, nice trade, I think that's it. Yeah. It is. Okay, so Fila in the lead, Taka maybe on his last stock of winners. Match seems much more doable than the mutual one. He should be able to, to finish uh, Fila's stock rather easily. Or at oh. least, yeah? No, no, go, go for it. Or, or at least pace himself to not get hit too much with uh, Cloud's uh, strong moves on, on shield. Mm -mm -mm. If, if Phila plays his cards right, the limit, yeah, okay. Taka just use it out of the blue. Not ready to get games. Okay. Once again, always making some tiny misspace stuff or not safe uh, approach uh, from the edge. So always an edge guard situation. Like, Fila does not manage... Oh, oh okay. Okay. I, I wasn't sure the forward shield was going to kill, and he definitely could have taken more time to choose his punish, but it was enough in the end. So Taka is sitting at 70% out of uh, Luigi's uh, deadly combo that basically puts you from 0 to 70, and with a limit, so he might be able to make something happen. Once again, I, I really feel like when Taka make a, make a pressure, he's not really respecting the, the Luigi. Yeah. Like, Running for uh, for a hit that are not safe on shield, running for grabs that are or space or uh, feel like and see coming, I would say, and just spot dodge and always the same situation. Like uh, Taka is way more in edge guard situation than than Fila is. Yeah, and that's like one of Cloud's weaknesses. But oh, again, he recovers and this could be bad. Yeah, okay, covers his landing with a down B. Oh, that was nice. Yeah, trying to turn my hope just a bit too slow with uh, Luigi's full speed. Taka was a bit to see it coming. Taka is always... And that's oh. it, yeah. I was about to say, even if he, if he gets hit, if it's not from a back air or perhaps a neutral air, should be able to, to leave this, but gets hit by the back air. And that's it. A 2-0 victory for Fila. 
Tekka let the, let the center way too much to yeah. Shila, I would say. Like, he moved around the platform and unfortunately he puts himself in a bad situation, like, all time. And Shila always just makes some steps, getting in the center, and was like, okay, now, come. It's my home. <laughs> now that's, that's done for you. That's done. That's my stage.